Okay, my name is Brooke, and the problem I was assigned is y equals secant squared pi x. And what I'm going to do first is just rewrite this as secant pi x squared, just because it's easier to visualize when you're trying to work through the problem. Alright, from here we're going to use the power rule. And first we're going to bring down the 2, it's going to become the coefficient, and then we're going to do secant pi x and then it's gonna it's gonna be to the first power now because we minus the one from two and then we're gonna have to take the derivative of the inside which is secant pi x and what I'm gonna do is just drop this down and then the derivative of secant pi x I have written here is tangent pi x times secant pi x and then since pi is a constant we're gonna have to pull that out next I'm gonna combine the two pi together in the front and then rewrite this out tangent pi x and then secant, secant pi x times secant pi x is secant squared pi x, and that is the final answer. Yay.